Hi. Uh, this time I like to show you how uh, all parts of the power supply looks uh, together in an enclosure. Uh, I will use uh, just an acryl enclosure for this demo. It's uh, nice because it's transparent so you can see what is uh, inside and uh, dimension it's similar to the real one uh, the metal one uh, which I'm waiting to to come from manufacturing so uh, let's start from the beginning AC power input uh, this one uh, it's uh, not uh, the final version what I'm willing to use and the problem with uh, this one is just a snap-in without any screws so on that 4mm uh, thick plate you cannot simply put it in place okay uh, auxiliary power board it's the old one uh, from previous uh, uh, release but uh, function functionality is the same like the newest one uh, only on the new one we have a USB isolator and position of Ethernet and USB port are, are swapped it's on another side and instead of uh, ordinary PCB trafo we are using a small AC-DC adapter which works with uh, 115 and 230 volts AC 60 millimeters uh, 60 millimeters uh, fan this uh, first and second power PCB and uh, here it's two two modules AC-DC modules first and second from other side it looks like this so uh, power PCBs it's fixed with that L profile on the bottom of the enclosure uh, here is some holes for for air and the same thing it's also on the top we have also holes here on the top for their circulation on the front panel uh, we have Arduino shield and one important detail is how that binding post are fixed to the PCB so uh, the original one looks like this depends on the thickness of the front panel you need to, to adjust it so my version it's like this so and here we can go completely With that metal spacer, and everything should go into place like this. This cable. Maybe better to to put it after. Okay, that looks fine. Okay, USB cable. It's here. Ethernet, it's here. USB on the 
Arduino side like this and now it's ready for for power on I forgot to show you uh, how the rear panel will look like uh, in the new version so it's like this so you can see that Ethernet and USB port are swapped and instead of this I'll use this one and this one goes with that screw so it will be fixed much better and now we can turn it on before that I'll put top ok it's in a standby ok it's ready for work Okay, that's all for this time. Thank you for the attention. Goodbye.